Wow, that's creative. I hadn't heard of that. Yeah, it, uh, it, it's interesting that there's even a setup where it would be cheaper to buy a longer flight right. instead of the, just the direct. But well, We don't need to go to Florida. We're perfect right here. You're right. Yeah, it's been great today, huh? Uh -huh. Blue skies, mm -hmm. warmer temperatures. Most of that continues tomorrow. Okay. It's just one little caveat that we could see some really spotty showers. I just want to mention it's so that no one gets caught off guard. But again, most of the day tomorrow, dry. We start with a live look outside. We'll go to Rope with Beach, Boardwalk Plaza, Hotel Camera. Had a couple people walking up and down. Nice evening for it. Temperatures have been mild and should stay that way overnight. To space we go from satellite and radar. A few clouds left over, dropping quickly. We're back to starshine to the overnight hours, and you can kind of see that setup for tomorrow where skies will stay clear and we'll get plenty of sunshine in. Let's time it out on Futurecast. Here's overnight into early Thursday morning. A few clouds work their way in. We're talking pre-dawn, uh, 4, 5, 6 a.m. And then by 8 a.m., a few clouds stick around, but a lot of sunshine coming through. Here's the spotty showers that I was mentioning. A few could get a quick shot of rain and take the location of this with a grain of salt. Uh, forecast models just showing that there's enough moisture in the atmosphere, just enough lift. All the ingredients are in place for really isolated showers. Maybe a rumble of thunder or two, but they're so few and far between that most of the day is dry. I think many of us go all day Thursday without seeing a drop of rain. Thursday evening drying out even more. It's Friday morning that we get a near miss from some rain, likely staying north. A boundary comes through and uh, we're left over with partly cloudy skies and lots of sunshine getting through. Temperatures warming up here. Many of us on our way to the upper 80s and low 90s and setting up for a very hot start to the week next week. Bigger picture here as we pick back up where we left off. Uh, again, there's that wave of energy that comes close Friday morning, but really just a near miss. The weekend's got a lot of sunshine and warmer temperatures. Highs pushing back into the uh, upper 80s, low 90s, and hot into early next week. There's the sun in place Saturday afternoon. I'll tell you up front, if you got any weekend plans, we look great. There's the partly cloudy skies. You see this forecast model not even painting the rain on the icons here. But I do want to mention just that isolated shower and thunder shower chance. Here's your seven day forecast. Mid to upper 80s, short term, drying out for the weekend and sunny skies. It's a mixed bag and uh, one note here, our coolest overnight low in the low 60s. Some could even be in the upper 50s by Saturday morning. A nice change of pace from the hot weather that we've had. That's not going anywhere. 91 on Sunday and 94 on Monday. The heat index will be even higher. Upper 80s Tuesday, low 90s on Wednesday. But for the most part, a dry week ahead and that uh, includes midweek next week. Kelly.